Hey guys, so a little while back I did show you guys a standalone COD mobile version that was on PC. Pretty much native, just as its own application. You could just launch, run, pretty smooth. And there was rumors that it was supposed to be coming to Battle.net back then, but I guess that wasn't true. Don't know what's happening with it. But today I have the most recent updated version to show you guys how to install. This is the kind of full version of it. Whereas last time I showed you, it was still in early access. So now they've got some new updates. And and you can already see some cool UI changes. And hey, if you guys like COD Mobile and you're thankful for this little install, be sure to hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it and it's free. But let's just hop right into the install process. This is a Chinese COD Mobile PC version. So you're going to need to get yourself Google Translate, preferably just on your phone. And then you can open the app and click the camera icon to just kind of put up to your monitor or screen to scan any Chinese translation you might need. You're also going to need to get yourself a WeChat account. That's W-E-Chat, one word. It's an app you can get on your phone. Just install the app and sign up and I think it has you verify with your phone number or I think a Facebook account. If you originally signed up when I made the previous video in early access, your account should still be there. If you are unable to set up a WeChat account, you could set up a QQ account, which I am much less familiar with though. But once you have an account made and Google Translate preferably, head over to this website right here, which I will link in the description down below. This is codm.qq.com. And on their front page, you can see that there's different options to install the game. Right here is a monitor, so click this. This is the PC version, and it's going to download a little EXE. When you run this EXE, it's going to open up this little application right here, and using Google Translate, Translate, I learned the bottom left is to accept their terms, and then the middle is to just click install. So once you click install, you're going to be going through a little bit of a loading process right here. And then it's going to say done. You can click to go to the next page. And now it's going to boot up the actual installer to install the files. And when this happens, it's going to pop up and ask you what drive you want to install the game on. So in my case, I have a C drive and a D drive. So I simply click to install it on my D drive. But feel free to install it wherever you have space. At this point, you're going to have to wait while it actually fully installs. Once it's done installing, you should now have a folder for COD Mobile on the root of that drive you selected. And there should be a shortcut automatically put on your desktop. So now anytime you run it, you should see this screen right here and simply click this middle button to start up the game. So it's going to take a few seconds, so you don't only click it once, and once you see the blue in the bottom right, you know that it's starting up. Now since I've played before in early access, I don't know if there's still a tutorial because it didn't throw me into one, but if it does throw you into tutorial, just try to back out of it and just leave it. But your first time booting up, it's going to download a couple things and go through a few different loading screens. Then you'll end up at the login screen where it's going to ask you to sign in with a QQ account or a WeChat account. So accept the terms in the bottom checkbox. And then on the left side is where we're dealing with WeChat. And the left box is for Android and the right box is for iOS. So I simply clicked iOS because that's where I have the app. And then it's going to pop up with a QR code. So then open your WeChat app and then click on me in the bottom right of it, and then you can click a little QR code in the top right, and then press scan. And then this will allow you to scan the QR code from your phone, and then it will log you in on PC. And once you've done that, you're pretty much good to go from here. It's gonna pop up with some stuff you can claim, or it might be even be asking you to buy some stuff. So just be careful what you click on, but you probably don't have any payments set up right away anyways, so it's probably fine. But just click through accepting your gifts and whatnot, or closing out of them. Then you should land on the COD Mobile main menu, Menu, which you should be familiar with by now if you've ever played it. You can go to the downloads and start downloading all the content if you'd like. But the game is going to direct you to start up your first match and just play. And then after you complete that, it'll eventually direct you to play ranked play. So you have to complete three placement matches in ranked play and be assigned a rank in order to actually add friends, I believe. But anytime you need to translate something, just whip out your Google Translate app, hold it up to your screen, or just refer to the actual COD Mobile mobile app as I think the layout's pretty much identical. But with that said, you now have COD Mobile installed natively on PC through a one-click EXE. I believe this is the full release now, as the original I showed off was early access, so updates should be automatic. But now the link I put in the description will take you to their actual website, so if there's any new launchers or something like that in the future, 
you should be able to get it off there. I'll do another standalone sort of dedicated video to show off more gameplay, but you can already see that there's a lot of improvements and changes from the mobile version to this PC version, which is really cool. If there's any updates in the future, such as being able to translate the entire game to English, or perhaps even connect a controller, I'll make a separate video and put it at the end screen. Thank you all for tuning in, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out.